Hey everyone, I'm Sleeping Booty and stay tuned for my Winterlicious tag. Hey everyone, so today I'm going to do the Winterlicious tag and for those of you who don't know, it's basically a winter tag all about your favourites and things that you're loving kind of in this season. Um, I've got my phone with me here with all the questions so I'm just going to get straight into it. But first, I've also got my, oh, my mug. Yeah. So basically, <laughs> the first question is, favourite winter nail varnish? Now, I love, while I love kind of dark, vampy nails, burgundy colours, I also love, I feel like Christmas is the one time of year when you can wear really crazy, bright, glittery nails and no one can say anything because it's festive. And I thought I'd show you a few of my favourite glitter nail varnishes that I like to wear around this time of year. And the first one up is this OPI nail varnish, and it's in Fresh Frog of Bel Air. It's from the Muppets collection that was out last year. I actually got this for Christmas last year, and it's so pretty. It's basically a clear varnish with green and silver glitter, and I, I love this. It looks really nice over black nail varnish. I actually wore this on Halloween this year, and I thought it looked really spooky, but it also looks lovely over... like white nail varnish or maybe just over one nail. Next up is um, one that I actually got free last year when I spent over a certain amount in Revlon and it's just a gold glitter. Now this is such a handy one to have and it looks lovely just on one accent nail over all nails and actually something I've been trying out recently is just over the tips of my nails so I paint my nails maybe black or a burgundy wine colour and just do the tips of my nails in this kind of goldy varnish. It looks really nice. Next is a cheaper kind of alternative for those of you who want to try out a sequiny kind of nail varnish but don't want to spend too much and it's the Angelica range and you can actually get this in Pennies or Primark and it's just a really fine black glittery nail varnish and it's just got tiny little specks of silver in it and I think it looks really nice over just all your nails on its own over white it would really stand out or even if just over some black nail varnish and with just maybe one finger or every second finger in this kind of glittery nail varnish. Next is probably my most worn glitter nail varnish. I've even worn this during the summer and it's the model's own head candy in Ibiza mix and it's a multicolour glitter nail varnish that looks amazing on its own or to be honest, I find it looks the best over white nail varnish. I literally just paint two coats of white, one coat of this, and it just stands out. It, it's so great. Um, if there's one nail varnish you buy out of all this, it should be this one. It's amazing. And lastly is one that I've kind of reserved for maybe Christmas Day or your work Christmas party or just any kind of festive occasion you have coming up and it's the Barry M nail varnish. Now the name is rubbed off but I feel like it's called something like red glitter and it's literally red glitter. It's really pigmented. The glitter comes out quite thick. It's really glittery. Uh, you could wear this on its own and just put over a top coat over it and it just it's gorgeous. I wore this on Christmas Day last year and I think it looks really pretty. So yeah that's the first question. Um, second question is favorite winter lip product. Now, I'm gonna be really boring with this one, and I'm gonna have to say I love the whole dark, vampy lip trend that's going on right now. Now, I usually wear a very bright red lip. I've worn it for years, but this year I'm trying to get into the whole wine burgundy. I've shown so many of these in my last few videos, and I probably my favorite one is the Kate Moss one. Um, it's a cheaper version of a lot of the high street, you know, the high end kind of brands like uh, MAC or Bobbi Brown and it's just a whiny colour, it's really pretty. If you do want to kind of get into the more high brand, MAC Rebel is also really pretty. Um, if wine lips aren't for you, you could go for a dark red. Um, Russian red is really good for that. So that's my favourite lip trend. Um, Next question, most worn winter piece. Now, in the winter, it's just too cold here in Ireland and it's really hard to make your outfit look chic or in some way fashionable and I've been known to wear 
jumpers pretty much every day. So I'm going to have to say jumper. I'm actually wearing one right now. This one is from Bershka. It's really pretty. It has like a bow on the back. You probably can't see. But it's really snuggly and cozy and I don't care. Um, most worn winter accessory. Again, this is really boring, but I'm going to have to say scarves. Similar to one that I've worn now. I love huge, gigantic scarves that wrap around your neck, uh, obviously. Um, but yeah, no, I love scarves. I have so many of them. I wear them in the summertime, springtime, autumn time. I wear them all year round. I think they're really great. This one, again, is from Primark, and it's two-sided. This side, you probably can't see in the camera, it's kind of navy with flowers, and then this inside is red, so you can wear it either way, or you can have it kind of wrapped both. So I love that. Um, next question is, fave winter scent or candle? Um, my scent is pretty much the same all year round. I usually wear the D&G number three, or Marc Jacobs Daisy but favorite candle is a toughie because I'm, I'm a huge candle fan but I think I'll have to say the Yankee Candle Christmas Cookie now this is a limited edition candle that only comes out at Christmas time and every time it does I grab about two of them unfortunately I don't have mine yet but I'm gonna grab that really soon apart from that I just love Basically, I love wearing scents that you feel you could eat. I love smelling like cake. I love smelling like vanilla, chocolate. I love all those. Um, next up is favorite winter beverage. Now, I'd be lying if I didn't say tea because, guys, as you all know from my videos, I'm obsessed with tea. But in the, to be interesting, I suppose I pick a festive kind of drink, and I've been loving the. Honeycomb Hot Chocolate from Insomnia um, I've also been loving the Orange Mocha from Starbucks uh, I, I love hot chocolate so any kind of flavoured hot chocolate at all I'm all over, I love it Next topic is have some tea um, All time favourite winter movie this is this is going to be a long one. I love Christmas movies. I love festive movies. I watch them all year round. I don't even know where to begin. Probably The Grinch, uh, Elf, Miracle on 34th Street, The Muppets Christmas Movie, Deck the Halls. Oh, I love so many of them. I, I would, I, any Christmas movie, I'm going to watch it. I'm obsessed. Um, favorite winter song? I don't think I actually have a favourite to be honest. I love all the classics. I I'm singing them all the time. Um, I like Snow is Falling. <laughs> Children singing, having fun. Okay, that's enough. Uh, <laughs> favourite winter food or treat? Okay, well. Pretty much all year round, I'm obsessed with cake. So, anytime I see any kind of festive themed cake or brownie or anything like that, I'm straight to it. I also love mince pies. I love Christmas pudding. I love Christmas dinner. I love potato cake stuffing. I love everything, all Christmas food. I love it. And um, I'm also really obsessed with selection boxes. I love the idea of just all your chocolate bars in one box and yeah oh, I love it um <laughs> next is what's top on your Christmas list I have no idea my mom has been asking me my friends been asking me and I don't really know what I want this year mainly I would love I love surprises so as boring as that is I'm looking forward to Christmas morning and opening up and having no idea what I'm gonna get so no hints there, family. Uh, plans for the holidays this year. Uh, really, I'm living up in Dublin at the moment and my family live back in Longford, so I'm planning to go home and spend a couple of days at home, have Christmas dinner, watch movies, eat constantly all day, stay in my pyjamas, and then actually the day after Christmas is my birthday. So I get to do the presents all over again. We have another um, Christmas dinner 
and we just did the same thing all over again the next day. So yeah, I can't wait. And guys, that's it for my Winterlicious tag. If any of you would like to do this, uh, leave a video response, or if you don't make videos, you could just copy and paste the questions and leave them as a response below. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, and if you would like to see more, make sure you thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and to my blog, and the links are just below. Thanks very much, guys. Bye! It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Do, 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 do.